you're about to meet a very special young lady named Katie Wicker. Katie was born with a lifetime of challenges ahead of her, but despite that, she's dedicated herself to inspiring hundreds of young people to look at the world in a different and more positive way. Let's find out a little more about her from her mom, Pam, and her sister, Tara. We first saw Katie as a baby. The first time I saw her, I felt like someone was standing over me with a bucket of love and poured this love into me and all the fear I had of taking care of her medical condition evaporated. She was adopted when she was three weeks old and she altered the course of our lives. Katie has what's called Treacher Collins. And she was born with a syndrome that affects the face. And she was born without cheekbones. She was born without ears. And she is just a ball of energy, fun, spice, you name it. She just brings the fun into our family. I was 15 and a half when Katie was adopted. So I was very much into what I looked like, who I was impressing, what boy was <laughs> I was liking. And I'll never forget the day I looked in that crib and I instantly fell in love with her, instantly. And my definition of beauty changed with, a, you know, a drop of a hat, like immediately changed. Katie is 23 now, and she's had about 60 surgeries. They've helped her hear, they've helped her see, they've helped her smell. I mean, all the functions that we take for granted. People are sometimes afraid because she looks different. So she's become quite adept at reaching out to people. She is so welcoming and so loving and so outgoing and so full of life. I mean, she's gone to beauty school. She's done vet tech school. She was a ski instructor. She speaks to classrooms about being different. She's done all of these things despite all that's been hard. It's like she's kind of taken it on as a challenge, as I'm going to tell the world that different is OK. And it's not just OK, it's good. We all have differences and her story has inspired thousands and thousands. She's a true example of loving no matter what. Katie's courageous approach to life has been a gift to so many people, so we really felt it was time to give her something back in return. We discovered that Katie has recently had to let go of two things she loved in her life. The first being snowboarding. Due to all the surgeries she's had, Katie felt that snowboarding was too risky and decided to give it up. The second thing was her dog, Oreo, who she always described as her best friend, but who recently passed away. So we put her love of dogs and winter sports together and came up with an experience that we hope will mean a lot to her, a snowmobiling and dog sledding adventure in the gorgeous Uinta Mountains. Katie's sisters live all over the country, so this also seemed like a perfect excuse to surprise her by flying them all in for an unexpected family reunion. I went to meet with Jordan at North 40 Escapes, who heard about Katie's story and promised to give her a memorable day. Hey, Jordan. Hey, Jenna. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. It's so great to be here. It's so gorgeous outside. It is. It's definitely some of the best views in the country up here. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely. Well, we're so excited to be here. We've been working on another big secret. We've flown in all of Katie's sisters from all over the country. Five sisters and her parents are going to be here. Do you have enough snowmobiles to get us up that mountain? You know, we're used to taking out big groups, but let's go outside and take a look at that. Andy. Oh, I would love that. Right. Let's go. So I think we'll have enough machines. Uh, yeah, I think we'll have enough. How many snowmobiles do you have? You no, know, we've got just under 30 snowmobiles. Oh, my gosh. And how do we use these things? Teach me. Yeah, they're very easy to operate. You've got your throttle right here. Cool. Most importantly, you have your brake here on the left-hand side. Okay. And they are two-seaters, so we can fit two people on at a time. Oh, that's cool. Tour so will take you right up the mountain. It's absolutely gorgeous up there, and we're going to stop right around 10,000 feet and what? get some of the best views you've ever seen. So how fast can I drive this up the mountain? Well, this will go a lot faster than we would like you to go tomorrow. Oh, all right. Note taken. <laughs> Fine. I also uh, heard something about you having dog sleds. Absolutely. We do have some huskies. Would you like to go take a look at them? Yes. All right. Let's go. <laughs> So 
this is the dog's sled here. Uh -huh. How many people can we fit in this? Well, we can fit two adults and one small child in the dog's sled. Okay, and tomorrow how many sleds will we have? We've got two teams just for your group. All right, so we can put two people in each. Yeah, and I was kind of thinking something might be a lot of fun. So what if we have a race? Oh, I love that idea. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, and then we could have the other other sisters not in sled, like time it maybe. Yeah, yeah. So everybody's kind of in. Okay. Yeah, I think that'd work out perfect. All right, so we got the sled. Can I please meet the dogs? They would love to meet you. Yes! <gasps> Hello! Hi, puppies. I love you. You are so precious. Yes, you are. Hi. You know, Jenna, it, it looks like you might be here for a while. So uh, I'm yeah. going to go work on the snowmobiles, and we'll catch up tomorrow. Perfect. All Thank right. you. We'll see you, you tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I am so excited about tomorrow. So many dogs, so little time. Today is the day. We're here at the Payson Family Pet Hospital where Katie works, and we've got Sweetie Belle with us. What's wrong with Sweetie Belle? Oh, nothing, he's fine. Oh, oh, I see, mm -hmm. sneaky. Thank you. You're so welcome. Morning. Morning. Who do you have with you today? Oh, Sweetie Belle. Aren't you checked in and a tech will be out front for you shortly. Great, thank you. Hey. Sweetie Belle. Ready, everyone. Katie can come out any minute. Just leave them through the first door. Okay, she's coming out now. Hi. Yes. Yes. Okay. Great. Okay. Oh, great. Oh, thanks. Oh, man. So, what is going on, Sweetie You know what? Sweetie Belle is perfectly healthy. Bringing him here was just an excuse to meet you. Okay. And believe it or not, we're not the only ones who want to meet you. What? Hi. <laughs> you are on the show Random Acts. Oh my <laughs> Where we do nice things for inspiring people. And we know all about you, Katie. We know how much you love snow and snow sports and being in the mountains. And we know that you haven't been able to do that a lot. And today we want to take you on a snowmobiling adventure. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and your boss is in on it, so we've got the whole day. Mm -hmm. Everything is taken care of. We've got snow gear for you. What? Uh, you no. no, and we have to leave now. Now? Yes, yeah. we have to leave now. Because we have a whole day of snowmobile yeah. adventures to go do. Okay. Yeah? Let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's go. I love that you're just ready to go. I know, I love this. <laughs> Here we go, everybody. Let's do it. So, have you always wanted to work with animals? Yes, I've always loved animals. It's so fun. That's awesome. I'm very lucky. Puppy appointments are the best. We have so many cute puppies all the time. I was like, I want one. <laughs> oh, I know. But what I live right now is like, no, I can't have one. It's just no pets at your apartment. Yeah. Oh, oh, that darn is too it. bad. Did you ever have pets? I used to have a dog, Oreo, that recently passed away. Oh, no. So, that's my girl. Oh my gosh. Yeah, she's my baby. She loves my baby. She's Whatever. still your baby. Oh yeah. No, Forever. For sure. Forever and ever and ever. So have you ever been snowmobiling before? I have not. I always want to. I used to work up at Snowbirds. You worked at a ski yeah. resort? I loved that. What was your favorite part of that job? Probably the people. There's just so many people from all over the world. It was fun. I'm excited. Heck yeah. Let's do this. I'm excited. New Stillman Ranch. Yay! Oh, such a pretty area. I just love it up here. Right. Look at this place. This is nice. Oh my gosh, it's just a winter wonderland. So we've got another surprise. Katie has five sisters and we've flown them from all over the country. They're hiding inside. Oh, and because of the logistics, we can't have our own private tour. Uh -huh. So we'll just like be joining another group. That's cool. Oh. Cool. It looks like that's the group that we're gonna join. Oh, 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 oh,
let's get ready to go snowmobiling. Yay. Yay. Let's, go. let's go. Where's Katie? I'm right here. Yay. Let's go. Love you, Mom. All right, love you. Have fun. Hey, Jordan. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Hello, everybody. Hey, Hello. we're so excited. Fantastic. Raise your hand if you've ever snowmobiled before. <laughs> Nobody. Okay, great. This is going to be a lot of fun today. You guys will do awesome. The biggest thing to remember is keep your distance from the person in front of you. Gotcha. These snowmobiles are very easy to operate. They've got a brake, just like a bicycle on the left-hand side. Okay. All right. We're going to get you up to just under 10,000 feet. Whoa. It's going to be gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. Couldn't ask for a better day than today. Yeah. Oh, kidding. All right. Do it. Okay, jump right. on your machines. All right. Let's go, guys. Yeah. Guys, I'm so excited about this. It's going to be awesome. Woo. Is everybody ready? <laughs> All right. Good. Here we go. Hey, you ready? Yeah, here we go. <laughs> Wild ride, get ready! Woo! Katie, you're crushing it. So fun, I love it. Yeah! Woo I'm not gonna stop smiling. I'm gonna have like permanent grin on my face the whole day. You're a good driver. I feel totally safe. Yeah. You ready to pick up some speed? Yeah. Me too. <laughs> Get it, girl. Big turn coming up. Fresh up. Too <laughs> All right, don't crash. Don't crash, Kara. It's so this beautiful. Is, like, it's incredible. I love it. Wow. <gasps> so beautiful. Unreal. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That ledge. Um, a little nerve wracking. I'm not gonna lie. I think we might be the only people in the world right now. That's what it feels yeah. like. That is what it feels like. Yeah. For sure. We're here! Hello! Hello. <laughs> <laughs> On your way into work today, did you think that this is what you'd be doing? Oh, I, no. <laughs> so true. How long since the original six had a little mix? Just the girls. Katie's graduation. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Five years ago. Five years ago. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Happy sister reunion! Yeah. Deep snow. <laughs> I'll take you to the ground. Holy <laughs> mackerel. I'll help you. <laughs> Love you. Oh, oh. <laughs> Here, I'll help you. <laughs> coming, we're coming. <laughs> Was I helpful? No. <laughs> oh, this is a workout, oh, you guys. <laughs> Can we be part of your family? Yes. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, that was oh, wide open. Um, all right, you want to drive? Uh, do you want I drive? want you to drive. Uh -huh. We made Woo! it! Oh, so yeah. Fun. Oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, God. Awesome. Katie, we hope that you have had just a fantastic day. It's been amazing. We are so, so glad because you absolutely deserve it. Yeah. Thank you. But it was like kind of spray. It wasn't that cold up there, right? No, it was not. Yeah. 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 You're hot. feeling good. You're not cold, right? No, I'm good. Well, good because we're not done today. Wait, what? Mm -mm. We're going dog sledding. No way! Yes, oh, way. <laughs> we really are. Right over there. Oh, and we're not just sledding, we're racing. Hello. 
Oh my gosh, beautiful. Oh, I want us. <laughs> these guys are asleep on the job. Emily, Katie, uh, these dogs are for you. That's fine. Yeah. They're conserving energy. Oh my gosh, Katie, this has been the hardest secret ever to keep. Like, for real. <laughs> Wait, how long has this been the worst? For a long time. <laughs> long time. I knew about the dogs. I knew you were going to love them. Well, <laughs> thank you. Animal lover. All right, this is genuinely going to be a race. Yeah, so we need to stop the family friendliness right yeah. now. Okay, because you so guys are going down. On. We'll okay. see about that. All right, we're going to do this time trial style. Who's got the timers? Yeah. Okay, Let's do that. I'm, I'm ready. ready. Go. One, two, three, yes! Yeah, guys! On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> So how much weight can they carry? Depending on the conditions, about 100 pounds per dog. What? Wow. Six and a half minutes. Oh, oh, and we stop. <laughs> Come on, Tom. <laughs> We're supposed to be winning. I could do this to us. I feel like this is the only way to travel now. Yeah. Our dogs are not lining up like they're supposed to. They missed the pep talk. At work, we see a couple of sled dogs. So it's so cool to see how they work. Yeah. And how do you decide who's the leader dog? The lead dogs are generally more intelligent, <laughs> and they're a little bit calmer. Are they super happy puppies? They are very happy. Aww. These dogs get loved on all day, and then they get to run, and that's, that's like the best basically life. their two favorite things. <laughs> Oh, we're going now. We're still going to win. I'm feeling very optimistic. Good. Nine minutes and 40 seconds. And we're going downhill. Get ready. <laughs> wow, that is so much fun. So what is your favorite part about today, Ben? Everything. Just being outdoors. Being with, <laughs> uh, with my family. Just everything. It's been so amazing. Ready for these bumps? All right. Oh, my gosh. Break yourself! Oh, my gosh! Fifteen minutes. OK, this one's a little bumpy. OK, here we go. Let's get it. Hi, Oh, this is so great. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Winning. We've got to be winning. Go, let's go. Go, 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 go. All right, this is the last real push here, doggies. Take us in. We're catching up. Woo, woo. Come on, guys. We're almost Make there. Make us win. Make us win. We can do it. Oh. We can still win this. Yeah, no, we can. Here we go. All right. Yay! Winners! Yeah. 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 Come on, go, go, go. to do a little something special for Katie. But let's, uh, let's go see who won the race. Oh, that was so fun. But enough of all of this friendly camaraderie. I need to know who won. So what was the time for Jenna and Tara? 18 minutes, 33 seconds. OK, that's well, going to be tough to pay. All right, good time, good time. Okay. How about Emily and Katie? That would be 18 minutes and 14 seconds. Oh! I know, you know, we would really love to take credit, but really the dogs did all the work, so. Really, really <laughs> Katie, we just really, really loved spending the day with you today. And we know that you can't have a dog right now. Yeah. We also know that you had a very special four-legged friend in your life. And right now there is a new generation of husky puppies here. And the ranch would like to name one of those puppies Aww. after your dog, Oreo. Yeah. 
Would that be okay? Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to meet him? Yes, I would. Okay. <laughs> Let's go meet him. Mason, bring him in. Oh, oh my God. Well, that is our show. Thank you so much for watching, and a huge thank you. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh, Hang on. Dear. We'll try that again. Come on, come on. Oh. Well, that is our show. A huge thank you to North 40 Escape and Payson Family Pet Hospital. Random Max on three? Yes. yes. One, two, three. Random Max! Oh, oh, oh.